Check it out, it's Dave Mustaine. Dave Mustaine is having a smoke out here. I'm late for fucking church. <coughs> Too much leche. She had to walk all the way over there. Here's the mic, the cookie. Chocolate chip or whatever, dough. I'll just eat a banana. <sighs> yeah, I made it to church right on time. to the kingdom of God. We get to sacrifice. We get to serve. We get to overcome. Lord, everything is suddenly has gone from obligation to a wonderful privilege. And we praise you for it as one more time we get to um, do something great for your kingdom. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you. Yeah, what we see in 90 seconds, turn our speaker loose. So honored. You know, it's it's interesting how somebody can be so successful in baseball and then, be, and then God can recreate them and do a brand new era to do something so extraordinary. And our speaker here tonight, I really believe, is one of the great voices in America today in helping with the drug epidemic. And we're so blessed to have him here today. And uh, I can't even begin to describe how much I love Daryl Strawberry. I, I remember when I was a kid <laughs> watching him hit that, hit the speaker of the Astrodome in a home run. And nobody believed it could be done. As a kid, I watched and I said, man, one day I would just love to be able to meet Daryl Strawberry. And now here I am, and I just have to pinch myself to believe it's, and now, but I get to see him in his greatest form. And that is not on the field, but the great reformer he is in touching hearts and lives all over America and letting people know that comebacks are possible, that with God all things are possible. Would you welcome tonight, Daryl Strawberry in the house. Come on, come on. Think about it, see. I wasn't all really I wasn't always like this. You know, when I think about it, when I was a liar, cheat a womanizer, alcoholic, drug addict, sinner, rich, famous, privileged, saved by grace. You'll never leave me nor forsake you. You will always be there. In the midst of the trials and tribulations of whatever it is, God is always there. He, oh hallelujah. He loves you so much. Oh, if I could just give you what he's given to me, he's given me his gift. And it's good. And it's Some parents told them to come to the program, but they are here by divine appointment, every one of them. And I just pray that they would just soar this year, God, that they would just realize that everything Daryl was talking about tonight, we know it's true. It is true, Lord. I got to feed the buffets. <laughs> Welcome to National Geographic Homeless uh, Edition. We've got a bunch of homeless animals out here living dirty. He's got no legs. Oh, sorry.